Thank you. Babies, yeah. before we're done here, y'all be wearing gold-plated diapers. What does that mean? Never question Bruce Dickinson. About to move into gate three, and now we're right to run. Red light. Carbonetti's on the toe in gate three, racing. Carbonetti was away fairly. Schoenacker half length slow. Scarlet Tufty, the inside, began well. Handed there as readily available. And likewise, a deal of humour with Justin Jed. Glenn Massey out three wide going forward, followed by Port Morant passing, drifting back. Schoenacker now a length and a quarter further back to Oz Legend. Scalago and in a wash, he's gone back to the rear. Up the railway side, they head. And Carbonetti's in front by length and a half now. Second, Scarlet Tufty. Third working forward is Glenn Massey and back to fourth is readily available, followed by Adil Ufuma, just a Jedi, a length and a half to Port Morant over on the outside of Shurnak and then Oz Legend. Scalago, the fence, and last of all is in a wash here, reckon nine or ten lengths off the leader. So Carbonetti, the race favourites in front by length and a quarter. Second, Scarlet Tufty. Third, readily available. And fourth, the outside is Glenn Massey. A length further back to Adil Fume, adjusted Jedi. A length and a half, Shurnak and Port Morant, followed by Oz Legend, Scalago, the rails, and in a wash is to last of all at the 1200 metres marker. So it's Carbonetti here by length and a quarter. Second, Scarlet Tufty. A length and a half away. Third is still readily available, followed by Glenn Massey on the outside. A length and three quarters to next one there. Back nearer the inside is deal of Fuma. The outside just a Jedi. Taking off is in a washy going forward three wide. Passing Port Moran. Shuffle back the inside there just in behind those Shurnak and creeping forward as Oz Legend. And Scalago is now last of all. So Carbonetti down the side at the 800 metres marker. In front still. Second Scarlet Tufty going to third. Glenn Massey. The inside is readily available. In a washy is going forward up to fourth out three and four wide further back to just a jedi port morant the outside getting sh shuffled back there was a deal of humor followed a long way back there by shernak towards the rear getting right towards the outside as oz legend and scalago's at the tail end 400 meters left to run carbonetti just in front looming up as scarlet tufty followed further back by readily available sticking up the inside there is a deal of humor and back in behind those is just a jedi but carbonetti still in front here trying hard down the outside is readily available, passing Scarlet Tufty in front, Carbonetti from readily available, Carbonetti's in front from readily available and Carbonetti has won from readily available and third Scarlet Tufty, followed by a deal of humour, Shernak was good late, followed by Glenn Massey and then just a Jedi, Oz Legend in a washy, Port Morant and the last one was Scalago. So Carbonetti has held readily available at Bay to win, so seven from three, and Scarlet Tufty stuck on for third. And uh, fourth is either Shernak out wide or a deal of humour on the rail. We'll have that number shortly. But uh, Carbonetti going all the way. Number the seven, the winner, Larry Cassidy for Chris.